Hey everyone, it's Laura with Pampered Chef here. So we are making a chili relleno. I hope I say that right. I, my, you know, I've listened to people say it and I always mess it up. So we're gonna make a casserole tonight and this is really easy. Now I'm really fortunate to live in an area where um, we have a local produce place that um, roasts their own chilies, but I'm gonna add to this. Um, I have several different kinds of chilies in my freezer. So I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do. Um, first of all, we've got our eggs right in here, and I'm going to add in some evaporated milk, and we're going to add in some other seasonings, including some flour, okay, and we're going to add in some garlic. Um, this is Pampered Chef seasonings, okay, so let me get the camera off of me and we're gonna add in some three onion rub because this is almost every video has me doing three onion rub right okay so I'm gonna show you this is our new flex so this is a cordless mixer but I'm gonna show you there's more to this okay so this right here actually we're going to mix this all up this is our batter I'm gonna go up a little bit higher, okay? So it has all those seasonings right in there. Now, what I'm gonna do is show you, I have a couple of more chilies in this, okay? So I'm going to show you, so you go right from here, okay? And then you undo this, not as easy to do it when you're on camera. And you go right over here. And now it's grind, it's processing our chilies. These batteries will last. They're 30 minute batteries and you get two. So now um, I don't even have to worry. Well, I'm all done. I don't have to worry about cords. My kitchen is set up in a way that's kind of odd, um, but it cords, I can't work with cords here on the island. So it's not the island I really wanted, but nobody asked me. All right, so we're gonna take this and I'm gonna add it, oops, the blade. Oh, nice people take blades out of stuff, I guess. All right, so now what we're gonna do is I'm gonna mix all this up and we're gonna spray, this is Pampered Chef's kitchen spritzer. So we just take a little bit of oil up to the fill line and you're gonna pump this. Now this is a re revised one. Um, so you do that and then you spray, you do, okay? Now when you're done with this, burp it, okay? So that way it releases that pressure. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our chilies and we're going to layer the bottom of this. Um, now I'm like double tripling this recipe, you guys. So if you wanna do something smaller, this is our new cast iron pan. This pan is a 14 by 10. It will hold a 15 pound turkey. Um, I did two chickens in it last week because it also comes with a rack just like this, okay? That way it's gonna roast really nice. Now, here's, we're gonna set this down, and now we're gonna add our cheese. Now you can add any cheese that you want, but I'm gonna show you our new grater. You guys, I'm so excited. This new grater, it's got huge grates. Look how fun that is. If you go to the store and you buy the farmer thick kind, and it's, crazy expensive, but now you can do it yourself. So now you just, look at how easy, as long as you don't eat the cheese in between, that's always my problem, because I like cheese. Okay, so, so now, I'm not gonna do all of it, because you guys know what it, okay? And then I'm just gonna layer it, and then pour this right on top, okay? and then put it in the oven. Now, after it cooks for about 25 minutes, I am going to put a can, 
You can use red. I'm going to use green enchilada sauce. You can use whatever you want. Now, one of the reasons why I used evaporated milk, evaporated milk is a creamier and it just tastes better. In fact, when I make mashed potatoes, I actually use evaporated milk as well. That's how I was raised, not to use regular milk, just evaporated milk. But my mama did that way. Your mama can do whatever way she teaches you. So I'll take a picture of this and I'll post the recipe. But you guys, I'm so excited for this. Today's the, it's not fall yet, but we can pretend, right? This is way better than pumpkin spice. Go ahead, fight me on those words. You guys have a great night.